Operation Blessing and Partners in Health opened Zanmi Beni Children's Home because of a dire need in Haiti to care for handicapped children who had been forgotten and ignored. These children had been living in a room at the National Hospital, discarded by their parents because they had birth defects. When the earthquake struck Port-au-Prince, the hospital was inundated with patients, and the room the children had been occupying was needed for trauma victims. A team from Partners in Health went in to evacuate the children the day after the earthquake. They asked Operation Blessing for help in saving them. Operation Blessing purchased an old estate in Port-au-Prince and started converting it into a safe and beautiful place to care for these young people. It's a truly nurturing environment. We moved 48 children to the site. These kids had been given up and forgotten because they have cerebral palsy, HIV, and developmental disabilities. Some of these children had never been outside before. Partners in Health have provided physical therapists. Where they had no means of rehabilitation previously, here, many of the children have learned to walk, their moods have been uplifted, and healing can begin to take place. Every child receives devoted attention and nurturing care from the team. Even with all of this good news, however, there are challenges yet to face. The property still needs a little work. There is a building on site that we hope to turn into a therapy and rehabilitation center. When that building is finished, we will be able to give even better care for all of these orphans. We will have a center devoted to doing physical therapy, which we now have to do wherever we can, sometimes even in our driveway. Operation Blessing has created an oasis in the chaos that is Port-au-Prince. It's a place where real healing can take place for those who otherwise would have been forgotten. Port-au-Prince is such a loud and chaotic city, but as soon as you come through the gates into Zamni Beni Children's Home, it's a totally different world. There are fruit trees and fish ponds, swings, and everything that these children need to not just have a beautiful place and beautiful home to live in, but a place where they can receive therapy and the love and attention that they need from a family. We're a new facility, but we're already seeing the effects of what this incredible place does for the children here. The best part of the orphanage by far is seeing the transformation in the eyes of these children. They come to us in despair, and through care and love that they have never had before, we see their entire world change. <laughs>